Hello everybody, Andrew Majewski here. So another thing that you think about afterwards, you know, I tried to think about, and that's to keep organized. When I was getting in all of my supplies, like my daisy chains, bibs, saliva ejectors, air water syringe tips, all of that, I thought, okay, how am I going to keep this nicely organized? What I was doing was I bought like a shoe box, like I bought a couple shoe box type boxes to keep them organized. And that sounds great, but I'm portable, so I can't just bring my shoe boxes with me because um, that takes up space. So I needed something thinner, um, but still to put a lot of stuff in. Um, because being portable means you don't just want one bib, one mask, one saliva ejector per patient, because what if you drop one? What if you lose one? What if something happens? You don't want to be standing there like, oh, I can't find my saliva ejector. So now you can't use it because if you're portable, you can't just walk into the other room to get it. So I always bring a couple extra of everything that I know I'm going to use. So as an example, and I hate this, but there's this huge label on, on my container, which I hate. But I got these, which so I still have to take that off. But this is from the dollar store, you guys. That's it. I think it was in the like tool section. But look, this is how I keep a lot of my things organized. Um, again, it's not perfect yet because I still have to decide what I need, what I probably don't need for everybody and work at it that way. But, you know, just, just to kind of show you guys, like I have a saliva ejector area. This is to help um, to attach them to the inside of the cheeks. For my fluoride, I have the little brushes. These tattoo rings, which are amazing, I use these for the polish and for the fluoride. So I just kind of keep it on my finger and it's just so much easier to put that inside the mouth, or not inside the mouth, put the brush in here and then use it that way. So these are disposable. My daisy chains, which I do sterilize after each patient. I got plastic here, I'm not sure where that came from floss for patients, dry angles. These are my polisher tips, um, my barriers for the polish. So thank you guys, whoops, as it all kind of spills out. But it just kind of helps to keep things organized in a much nicer way. Imagine if I put all of this in a box. Yes, it sounds great, but then you have to lug through. Another thing that I decided, um, and I just bought this from the dollar store. They have organizers on Amazon, um, Patterson, Maxill, all of those dental places, but they're like 20 bucks each. So why not just get one from the dollar store? I love the dollar store. Another dollar store item I got is this, okay? I wish it just came in like white or black or something. I don't love the green color, but oh well. So for each patient, this is my tray. So not my actual tray. Do I have my tray here? So I do have an actual black tray that I put all of this on so it looks nicer, but all of my components of the tray I put in here. So let me sit back to kind of show you. It has a lid. So how amazing is that? So your, you know, bib, daisy chain, all of that, I put in here to keep it organized. So this is per patient. And to take it a step further, I bought a thin Tupperware container, like so, to put the smaller items in there, and then I put it in here. So it's kind of messy now because I have to organize it. But can you guys see? Like I have gloves, I have my notepads, which I love. I have my notepads to like write things on. <laughs> my piezo tip, you know, my shade guide things like that so i keep so per patient so this is per patient so i kind of put it in there and then i close it up and it just really helps to keep things organized so when i see that so when i'm setting up my trays for my patients i don't have to take out a big box look for the saliva ejectors you know gauze instruments all of that i just have it in here so i know it's all here if I forgot something, if something falls on the floor, I go to this thin box and that's it. So it keeps it really simple, really easy. I put it all in a carry-on luggage, luggage, and it's just easy to keep it all intact that way. So things that I learned over time, 
because when I first started, I had like shoe boxes of shoe boxes in my luggage container, but there's only so much that you can fit in there. And then when I opened up the box to look for, say, one thing, the air water syringe tip, you're looking, 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 but it can be hard to find. Whereas my air water syringe tips, I just keep in a little sleeve in here and then I know exactly where it is. Things you learn over time. So I hope that that helps all of you guys to stay organized. And if you have any questions, just let me know.